Yeah, this is Luke's storage GI Joes. Yeah, which implies that there's GI Joes that aren't they're out that aren't in storage someplace. But this is all of the GI Joes, so is I was it? being redundant. You don't have any more. If I had them, I'd bring them out for right. this video. Right. Video is life. Yeah, this is our lives, guys. If you don't subscribe, then oh my God, I dude. will die. Let's break into these toys. All right, so first, first up, first up, when I was a child on my birthday, I received these two toys, and like this one is a GI Joe Jeep. It's has a good color scheme. Let me get it, let me get it in there for okay. you. Okay. Yeah, get it All right, this is the G.I. Joe Jeep. Uh, there you go, a little focused. There he goes. Boom, boom. Look I at that. I put the stickers on pretty good. Some assembly required. Yeah, these will all be taken off. You have to put them on yourself. Yeah. And then the stickers will be on a sheet, and there'll be an instruction manual telling you where to put the stickers. It comes right off. It comes right off. I could choke on that right now. G.I. <laughs> Joe. Yeah, a lot of kids died. And there's a missile too, right? Where's the missile at? I found it. Oh, you did? Yeah, do it, do it, do it, do it. Bam! Nice. It is missing the, the dental floss that held the missile in place. Yeah, my mom, she tied this string on to the missile launcher so that when it shot the missile, it would just stop and then I wouldn't lose it behind the couch. Clearly, she didn't believe in me or my skills to find missiles. And that's separate from the toy review. <laughs> that's another review coming up about my mom. Are we doing a podcast, a video where we review moms? <laughs> yes. Can we do that? Can we do that? <laughs> is that allowed? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we're today we're reviewing my mom. Uh, <laughs> just like a picture of her up. Pretty good mom. Uh, Pretty good mom. I'm trying to think about the, what the scale will be, because like for this we're doing hooded commanders, right? Yeah, so what do you give this Jeep out of? Um I like the color scheme. Yep. You know what I like about it, you know what I hate about oh, it. Oh, so what you don't like is this. I hate this. I'm gonna give it a solid three out of five hoods. I would give it four out of five because I had lots of good memories. So then we have this. Bam. Same collection. I got these on the same birthday. Mm -hmm. So that this birthday one, was twenty one. This is, yes. <laughs> this one has the same missile launcher. Mm -hmm. Same so missile could be used in it. Tony Stark was dealing under the table. Selling weapons to both sides. Yeah. It has the same roll cage. Mm -hmm. And then inside, uh, a Cobra Cobra had an accident. That's, I don't know if you can see, but there's down. a stain. That's a down for me, bro. So there's a poop. <laughs> this doesn't have good diaper protection. It also makes that horrible noise. Same design flaw. One second. <coughs> Thank you. Uh, if I had to, you put a gun to my head and I had to rate this one. I like the fact that you could take your girlfriend with you on a trip. Just put a towel land. down in case, <laughs> that, so she doesn't see your yeah. poop stain. Yeah, <laughs> poop stain really makes me <laughs> nauseous. I give it, again, three hoods out of five. Where's your score? 2.5, because yeah. I never liked that it had skis. Like, it's not all-terrain enough for me. I like all-terrains. All right. So now we move on to the Starfighter. And this is upsets me. This one upsets me a lot. Um, this is pretty cool, I think. It's not very aerodynamic. It is. It's a lie. It's Engineer. a lie. If you're yeah, all the engineers watching right now, comment. Yeah. If you're an aerospace engineer, comment down below. Subscribe, like, comment, subscribe, yeah. and do all those things in order several times. And mm -hmm. just tell us that this is aerodynamic, because if yeah. you throw it, hot, gotcha. And no, no one got it. No one. We don't need to have the fuel conversation again. We but don't. It takes too long. I'm, Kevin thinks that this is dangerous. It's dangerous. But it's First less time. dangerous right. than the Apollo mission, which fine, I would say fine. you're still sitting Apollo on mission. thousands of pounds of rocket fuel. Also, first off, it was the Challenger that exploded, not the Apollo. But those also might have exploded. All right. So just, just why don't you? Dangerous. Why don't you say what you like about it? Give it a rating. I'll say what I hate about it. I like the overall design is very cool and. I could slice through space in this spaceship. Four out of five. Wow. First off, this cannot shoot from Earth into space. You have to attach it to something to get it. There's no way this is making it through the G-force and through the atmosphere. The cockpit is extremely loose. That gets into space, you're going to hey, die. that's just age. That's just, uh, well, I, okay, fine. I hate the design, the fact that the fuel lodge is underneath where you sit. That is terrifying to me. If anything happens, you are extremely dead. Thirdly, the fuel exhaust, this, this is right next to where your head is. Let's say you're trying to take a nap. You're trying to like float through space, take a nap because you're going to Dagobah. And it just like, like all this heat. You're not going to sleep. There's like heat just coming out of there. It's it's so bad. It's you don't think it's insulated? I don't think it's insulated. It seems... I mean, it is plastic. It is plastic and there's no engine. <clears throat> so I'm going to give it one out of five. All right, that's fine. Okay, so now we have this case that I have. Hey, AK, AK, if you're watching, we'd love to have you on when you're 18. No, when you're 18. When yes. you're 18, you can be on the show. Yeah, legally. So, 
This is a really cool G.I. Joe case I got. I actually like the case. I'd give the case 5 out of 5. But the thing is, is I put little Orca stickers all over it. Which I love. They're kind of like a ripoff of Street Sharks, but it says I... Club Shred Whales with an Attitude. <laughs> That's when killer whales were the coolest. In the 90s? Fuck yeah, dude. Do you not... Look at this. If these were people, would they not be Samoans? Like the, the, the conch shells? We're gonna cut that out. <laughs> you don't think so? Let's break this bad boy yeah. up. Which guy first? Do you so, want first guy I ever got? I'll find this card. You ripped off the card. Sci-fi. Wait, don't get them out of order. They're in order. How are they in order? I have OCD. Just... There, sci-fi? Oh, yeah, that's the one. Here's this. I cut yeah. the card out. We're not professionals like uh, HCC is. This is sci-fi. That's his butt. His helmet comes off. And I don't know what he looks like besides... I used to put this on my finger and I'd be like, ah, ah, ah. I don't know, I just did that a couple times. Put the helmet on. <laughs> now he's ready for space travel, yeah, apparently. as anyone is. I feel like you should have organized this a little bit before we started. It's part of the fun. So this is the best missile launcher of all time. And this shoots really far. I get how to Wobbly top, legs definitely can't hold itself up. He's sassy, I like how sassy he is. Hey, I'm sorry for I'm full of sass. I imagine he talks like this. Hey y'all, I'm gonna go to the store. If it want anything. <laughs> Alright, it's fun. Uh, I don't know what you want to rate him. 10 out of 5, this is the best five. one ever. My first one, it's the best <laughs> one. What did you rate him? Uh, I'm gonna give him a 3 out of 5. Cause I'm gonna give everything three out of five. Hey, there's Allie. She's back here. <laughs> Say hello. She's doing her. Happy birthday, Allie. <laughs> Happy birthday. Luke, you son of a bitch. All right. She did not want to be in the video. She is now. We can pause it, you know. So this is a fan favorite, right? Major Blood. You want to pause it so they can get out? We're gonna take it for a walk. Can find all of his little toys. Next Man, up is the a Major symbol. Major Blood. Major Blood fan favorite. I'm gonna. Yeah. Even... Major Blood, file name, Blood, comma, Sebastian. <laughs> Sebastian. <laughs> Birthplace, Sydney, Australia. I okay. like to eat koalas and ostrich eggs. Why are his teeth sharp and pointy? Look at this. His teeth. Back it up, back it up. Back it up. Back it up, Chloe. Yeah. Back it up. Back it up, back it up. Back it up, back it up. Back it up. Back it up. There it is. Oh, there it is. Bam. Look at his teeth are shiny. What the and now fuck we're not... are spiky? Spiky? His teeth are spiky. I don't like giving out his personal information like that, but I mean, <laughs> that's up to you, Oh, man. shit. We just doxed Major <laughs> just Blood. Just doxed Major Blood. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. my God. This card is amazing. Specialties, terrorism, assassination, and process <laughs> serving. Where did he get those degrees? Like, <laughs> where did he go to get that? At Evil Careers College. You can do it! Major Blood is a total mercenary slime who total. would think nothing of renting out his own grandmother can, can as a tackling like dummy. Wait a minute. <laughs> you gotta read it like a, read it like did, a surfer guy. Did you hear what it just said? I know, but I read it like a surfer guy. He's Why? like totally... Alright, read it the way you want to read it. It yeah, doesn't need a voice, it's already like, funny. Everything needs a voice. Oh, it's a ca catalog? It's a catalog. Oh my god, I wanted all those toys. Dude, who didn't want all these toys? So back in the day, kids, they give you like a poster that you could like want and like jerk off to all the toys <laughs> that you don't <laughs> you just pull this out for Christmas and start marking it. Be like, Mommy, I want it. I yeah, want with it. your little pre jizz <laughs> cum. It's like, oh, I guess we'll get you the one yeah. that's the stickiest. <laughs> Usually in the back there's like a cool poster. This isn't a cool poster. This is just more licensed products from G.I. Joe. But they're like not exciting because they're not action figures. It's no, just like it's a... just like... It's just pictures of kids, which is not jerk-offable. Yeah. <laughs> you gotta be very careful which side <laughs> you jerk off to. Dude, this card is so gold. Yeah, read it, dude. Okay, so you already heard the grandma's tackling dummy line. Yeah. Wanted on three continents just on general principles. <laughs> <laughs> He is adept Just with plastic time. explosives, long-range sniper rifles, garrots, whatever that is, blunt instruments, poisoned ice picks. <laughs> Wait, what is this? It says he's also adept at Saturday night specials. <laughs> and anything with nasty spikes sticking out of it. Who wrote this? A 12-year-old? <laughs> well, this actually was a contest to write Major Blood's card. <laughs> when he heard Cobra had invented the ultimate in Sonic Weapons. That dick right there. He promptly went out and stole his own private arsenal. Major Blood writes really bad poetry. <laughs> Rhymes that get rejected by Wait. prison newsletters. Wait prison is all capital. Wait a second, look at this, Luke. It says right here, written by Hooded Cobra Commander. <laughs> Whoa, 887. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> 
<laughs> you didn't see it coming, did you? It's a twist. Wait, where's the card? Oh, I put it away. I'm, I'm not done. There's, not one done. There's, more. there's more. All right. Rhymes that get rejected by prison newsletters. Limericks that miss the beat. Haiku with 16 syllables. <laughs> and freeform couplets about assault rifles and bayonet lugs. This guy's way into poetry. Can you imagine working for a guy in a terrorist organization who's trying to get you to read bad poetry about like, his weapons? He's like driving the truck to kill G.I. Joe's like, Hey, mate, I wrote a poem. You want to hear it? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> he's on the other side of the car. Because and his Australia. poem is like, Stabby wabby <laughs> grenade. Stabby wabby poison ice pick. <laughs> Just snapping a lot. It's like not even rhymes. So those who have received manuscripts from Major Blood would have preferred letter bombs. They would rather receive the equivalent of the Oklahoma bad. City bombing. <laughs> It's almost as bad as being in a car with like the Uber driver yeah. and he turns to you and goes, Hey man, I wrote a screenplay, you wanna hear it? And you're yeah. like, How do I get out of this car? I thought I requested no talking. <laughs> They're like, he's so into his poetry that you'd rather get a bomb that explodes your face off. What would you rate Major Blood? Oh, five out of five hoods, baby. Just because of the card? Just because of the card. Yeah. It's so good. I also have I have Wild Bill, but I had to replace the rubber band as you can see. Oh yeah. So now he's dancing Wild Bill. It reminds me of Woody from Toy Story. <laughs> Howdy, partner! <laughs> uh, Wild Bill gets a 5 out of 5 because he looks yeah. like Teddy Roosevelt. He's also a classic. So I have this General Hawk. He also had to have a replaced rubber band. If you hold, he can't hold himself up. <laughs> I really want to talk about this, this guy though. This color scheme is great because it reminds me of the New York Knicks. Get up in there, baby. I'm terrible. More. Ooh. No, less, less. Put it closer. Up, down, left. What is wrong? Up, down, left. Up, down, left. Maybe it is. This action figure is actually blurry. <laughs> oh damn. Okay. You just and, gotta put it in the right spot. And the spot. cool part is his head. Head only comes up up a little bit. Yeah, and you can see his creepy little beady creepy eyes. Little eyes. In there. It's like why even wear a helmet if you're this creepy inside? I like this one. This is a five out of five for me. He's like a reverse Captain America. How is he reverse? Because he has a snake eyes. Oh, okay. And he has a shield. I mean. Isn't America kind of evil? You know what I'm saying? Whoa, whoa, whoa. It's not that kind of video, Kevin. <laughs> it's right, it's not. It's we not. are tax-paying Americans, That's all right? right. <laughs> I was gonna say that I have like two favorite basketball teams and that's the Sacramento Kings and the New York Knicks because they're, they suck. They all they all suck. And as a Kevin, it's hard to find sports teams that start with a K and I love the and color Knicks schemes. Knicks barely starts with a K because it yeah. doesn't sound Knicks. like it does. Knicks. 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 I call them Knives Knicks. I can know what you're talking about. <laughs> uh, uh. I'll be here all, all video, guys. <laughs> Did I get the light yet? Uh. <laughs> wow, I can hear everyone fast forwarding through this part. <laughs> on, on YouTube. This is also one of my favorites. This is probably second favorite after sci-fi. This is Big Bear. Oh. oh. <laughs> five out of five. It's, they have these rubber bands in their little bellies yeah. and they rip, they break, they and break. they're not good. If so... you play with them too hard, they break. Mine never broke. Come on, I'm just getting focus. You trying to get his ass into focus? Look at this. I got a Destro oh, yeah, with a broken guy. arm. This guy's awesome. Destro's yeah. great. And this looks like Space Destro. Yeah. Is this Johnny Quest? What is this? I know this Oh, is... that's from Sequest. We are his guardians. For beneath the surface lies the future. Sequest. That's that kid, he died, the actor. Oh. Hey everybody, it's me. I can't get in focus. It's me, the actor from Sequest. I'm a ghost now. <laughs> Ooh. Hey everybody, it's me, Kevin. I'm here with Luke, <laughs> doing a review on toys. <laughs> My name's Cheetah Print, and I'm here to kick ass and take names. And I don't understand names. How long are we filming? This is too long. Oh, we're getting we're is at there... we're at the two hour mark. So, so last, last guy. guy, Storm Shadow. This is a really cool character. Mm -hmm. All I remember is that he's a ninja and he was bad, and then he becomes good. Yeah. Do you want to review it? Yeah. Uh, again, dingly dangly legs, which is cool. <laughs> uh, it doesn't stand up. Which is sad. Cool, cool weapons. They're really clean. I really like that. He probably disinfects them. He's wearing a mask. He's so even G.I. Joe knows. Sometimes you have to just, just take one for the team to stop COVID-19. Five out of five. If I could, <laughs> 10 out of 10. Watch, he has a cool trick too. You can wind up his arms. Oh, nice. So like, you can kind of like, I'll grab his face and you wind up his arms like this. Oh, it's oh. gonna break, it's gonna break. No, it's fine. And then, yeah. Oh yeah, did you see that sweet ninja action? I saw it, it was great. I can't imagine. Ah, it's so fast, it's not even, you have to almost be like inhuman to see I it. can't imagine uh, Hooded Cobra Commander 877 or whatever doing a better review than we just did. 
to wrap things up, I think yeah, it'd be yo, great. Yeah, yo, come at us, bro. We're not afraid of your chloroform. I'll but fight. That seven year old is. <laughs> <laughs> he just the seven year old just like wakes up in a ditch, being like, "Where was I?" The just, seven year old is gonna wake up like this, like. Now. Where's the rest of my body? <laughs> Why does my butt hurt? Oh no. I am going to wear this mask. Real quick, Luke, real quick. <laughs> let's just pick our top three action figures, okay? Uh, Optimus Prime. No, I mean out of the box. I mean out of the oh, box. Oh, well you already know. I'm not gonna pick the ones you picked, so. These are my top three. I also my, would pick Wild Bill. My G.I. Joes. My girlfriend loves this. We play these together all the time. Instead of having sex. Yeah. Look, guys, have you ever spanked a girl's ass with this? No. <laughs> She's like, is it inside yet? I can't tell. <laughs> So first off, first off, it's major blood for me. That guy's card was hilarious. Second is orange and blue guy, because those color schemes are fucking bomb. Look at that shit. And a shield. He has defense and offense, just like the Knicks. And third for me yeah. is Leatherneck. Comes in third, because he's got like a spinny, like, he's, his arms can spin. And he's just a badass with some cheetah print. All right, well, that's, that's so our video. That's our, v, our video. Oh, man, I see why it takes 17 minutes to go through a fucking G.I. Joe figure. Yeah, we did like eight of them. We did like, like so comment, many. subscribe, follow. Kevin, what's your email? Well, my email is my email, my personal email account. Um, no. no uh, I think True Real Kevin. At True Real Kevin, one word. It's on Instagram, twi Twitter, Twitch, all that stuff is the same. As opposed to False Fake Kevin, which you should yeah. also make. I, he is my, my rival. <laughs> False you should do Kevin. that and then do like a, a reverse color yeah. thing where yeah. it's like a, neg a negative exposure. Yeah. Oh no! Yay! All right, guys, we got to wrap this video up. The roommates are coming in the house, <laughs> and they're, I'm embarrassed with all these action figures out. I didn't. We're they all don't know. Luke. They didn't know that I had them. True, old Kevin, fake Kevin, and thank you. Epic Tiki, follow it. Uh, Was that like a, you giving the rose to someone? Yeah, rose. And uh, spank your ass. <laughs> You have to follow up on that. Alright, I think it's good. Spank your ass. Spank your ass.